going guys welcome to today's video bj coming back at you today is june 5th 2023 it's 8 30 right now 8 30 p.m i was contemplating on not coming and i said nah the hell with that i have to hit the gym i gotta get my workout in but i also have to go and get some food i'm gonna go and i'm i'm probably not gonna eat it all but i want to get some teriyaki and some teriyaki chicken and rice so i'm gonna just hit panda express because i know it's like probably one of the quickest places i can go right now i'm in the area right now so i'm gonna go and get that that food and get out of here and then go work out at the gym today is gonna be a i don't even want to call it a light day but it's just gonna be pretty basic i'll do like some leg accessories and i'm just gonna do cardio and then bounce out uh Yesterday, I got a pretty decent workout in. I've actually spent a lot of time kind of working on videos to post. So I've been doing that. I started posting a couple more shorts. I've been posting videos in the past. I'm gonna catch up really quick, guys. So don't you worry about it too much. I'm probably always gonna keep like at least two or three weeks ahead of time. I always record, so it's really a matter of me getting in and then doing it like I, I got to a point to where I started to say eh, yeah I'm not gonna I'm just gonna wait to post and I have like so much backlog footage that I started running out of footage on uh, like on some of the stuff that I was posting and I said no let me just start kind of getting this content out and my objective is 52 videos a year so um, I think I've already posted like 150 something just overall. I'm just gonna keep posting, keep trying to get better, and I'll keep on keeping on. So my next video, I think is it's crazy because it's June now, but I think my next video is like probably December-ish, December 7th or so. But I'm just gonna keep posting. Like it gets to the point to where I don't record daily. I kind of got a habit of recording like if i didn't think anything interesting was happening i wouldn't record anything and so i would just delay and then not record but i catch up very fast and then we'll get back into it but okay it's a little line here <sighs> two people in front of me but i'm gonna get here order my food buy my food and then go from there go get a workout in at the gym See you guys in queue. Well, I'm gonna, and here I'm gonna get the usual. I'll probably do half and half rice and uh, chow mein, and then I'll get chicken. I'll get uh, probably teriyaki chicken and uh, some other kind of chicken. We'll see, I'm not sure which one I wanna do, but time will tell on that one. Man. It's been a while since I've been here. I told my boy Rob I was gonna show up to this place. What was it? I think yesterday. And I kind of put off on it, but we're here now. Like it's funny because this location is right across from the Chili's that I would typically go to. But I've lately I've been going to the Chili's. It's closer to my to my gym because I would just go there like when I'm coming back home. But we will see. Time to get it in. <laughs> Hi, how are you? I'm good, and you? I'm pretty good. Could I have the uh, plate meal? The plate? Yes. Okay, what's your price? Uh, could I have uh, what half and half rice and chow mein? Half bread, rice and half chow mein? Yes. Okay, and then what were your entries? Uh, could I have orange chicken and uh, what is the grilled teriyaki chicken? Okay, uh, could I do honey sesame seed chicken? Honey sesame chicken? Yes. Alright, so play half, half uh, fried rice, half chicken, orange chicken, and the honey sesame chicken, anything else? Yeah, no, that's all. Chicken, they have like actually, I think, what is it, the honey walnut shrimp too, which is pretty nice. Alright, you got a plate. Yep. actually unorthodox of me to actually pay with money 
I usually don't ever do that. I always have a card, but I took some cash out to say, why not? Why not? Actually making pretty decent time. Too. It just ran out of change, so I just gave it back to All right. All right. Lucky day today. Thank you. Have a good one. The biggie bag has been secured in my baby. Oh, those guys must be going to the panda. Panda Express makes people get really desperate. They start wanting it. Unfortunately, they didn't have my sesame. It's my sesame seed, but. We're gonna do a taste test before we make our way in. Cause it's, it's 8.40 or 8.38 now, which is eight, almost 8.40. But one thing I will say is like 10 bucks, you get this small thing. That's unacceptable to me. And then sesame seed chicken, rice and chiming. But 10 bucks. I guess it's not that bad. One thing about this chicken is not much, it's more vegetables than this chicken. Well, the chicken is pretty good. They're about to close too, I think. So that's why they ran out. Pretty good. A couple more bites. And then we pop up in the gym. Gym time. It's almost 11 o'clock. It's like less than 20 to 11. So I gotta change up. Kind of fresh enough to get out of here. So it's the plan. But by the way, it's 620. Bam. Time to go. See you guys tomorrow. What's going on, guys? Welcome to today's video. DJ coming back at you. Rumble action happened. It's rumbling. But welcome to today's video. Today is 6-6-23. LeBron, 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 Russell, Jordan. That's what it is. It's June 6, 2023. On my way to the gym now. Uh, it's 8 o'clock now. I waited a little bit, I posted some videos, edited some stuff, and now I'm just making my way there. And this is, this is unacceptable. The shake. The shape was unacceptable. But I'm going to the gym right now. I had the choice or going, I could have went earlier today, but then I started working again. And I was man, I don't want to leave until I finish all of this stuff. So I just kind of worked on some thumbnails, did some other editing stuff or some other projects and then kind of worked on my own personal stuff. Got a couple videos up and then like 
I'm gonna start working with thumbnails for those. Uh, it's been crazy times, man. It's been temperature dropped down again. It got colder, that's why I'm wearing joggers. And I'm gonna go in the gym and work out. It's gotta be since eight o'clock. Gym closed at eleven. I'm gonna go. And, I mean, I say it like it's a bad thing, but I'll get like a two and a half hour workout in and get out of there afterwards. But we're gonna try our best to make it happen. These guys are driving like they're crazy, man. I don't get it. I don't understand why these people slam on the brakes like that when there's no one in front of them. But anyway, I'm gonna go to the gym, work out. I was gonna get some food before, just to have it, and then kind of do what I did yesterday. That way I wouldn't have to kind of go searching for food afterwards or eat. I may just eat what I have in the house. Uh, I know I don't have any more ground beef chicken there. I have plenty of rice. I may just eat oatmeal and whatever else I have in there. I'll eat protein bar or something. I don't know. But today I think I'm doing uh, yeah I'm going to do back and arms. I did legs yesterday. I'm going to do some back biceps and then cardio. And the cardio is the most important thing for me because it's been cardio drinking plenty of water and then I've kind of talked about it but just like cutting down more on just like food intake. I'm not really too concerned about necessarily what I eat but I'm trying to make sure I'm eating uh, enough to where I'm at a cal calorie deficit that way I continue to go down and I've kind of gone away from uh, I really only eat once a day for the most part I eat multivitamins and like bites and all of that stuff mornings and then I eat one meal generally I ate some before yesterday but generally like my the bulk of my calories comes in after the fact so I'll eat that food and then I'll kind of fast or just drink water throughout the night and then wake up drink more water may have like a snack with like a protein bar or something and then I kind of go back into working out so that's kind of what I've been doing a little bit I feel pretty good just doing my cardio and stuff so I've kind of stuck on that that's been my goal for the last couple of weeks feel pretty good being back in the gym too I've been thinking also should I that should I even get a membership at uh, Wayne State because I kind of like going to this gym Kind of gets me out of the house and I can just drive there and I don't have to worry about parking and all that other stuff. And as I told you, the pluses and the minuses, I went in there, did it. I I think the uh, Miss San sent me a message telling me, uh, like giving me the confirmation, but I'm not going back in there until Sunday anyway. And that's kind of my thing. Like, so if I'm paying for it, I'm just paying for the nostalgia of it all, just to go in there on Sundays. That way I don't have to drive any further away. And I guess I can justify that three months, maybe possibly going in there, I guess for the remainder of the summer. And then just uh, like kind of going away from that $10, I think it would be $10. So that's what they were charging for like daily entry fees. To get in there, it's probably like 20, 25 now. I'm pretty sure they've raised prices. But if I pay 35 for that semester and then go in there a couple of times, probably would be worth it so I wouldn't have to drive in that long distance to get there. So we'll see. I mean, I, I really want to go in there and see what's happening in there, see if like anything's changed. I'll just bring my smaller bag, go in there, work out, and then leave. But it, like I said, it's closer proximity to me. That's kind of the only plus to it. But I think, I think it's kind of like there, like the hierarchy, that Planet Fitness is like the bottom. Wayne State is like in the middle, and I think gyms like Hype uh, Fitness are up there. Like, I mean, you could say LA Fitness and, and Crunch. I think LA Fitness, Crunch are kind of like same tier, but gyms that don't have like basketball court areas, like track areas and all that stuff, needs to be all encompassing. And if they don't have it, then I kind of, I, pu I put it like a tier below. But we'll see what happens. I'll look at the email, check it out, see what she's talking about. And then on Sunday, if 
If I don't go this Sunday, I'll go next Sunday and debate it and then see if I want to go in there or not. Because when I went in there last time, I was kind of disappointed. Damn. And let me in here. Oh, you got to get the email confirmation. I thought she sent me the email confirmation for me uh, telling her, like, oh, I'll come in here in the summer. I'm not really trying to come in and do a winter membership because the whole idea of going in there is I want very, I want minimal people in that place. And I know if I go in there on weekends and if I go in there in the summertime, there's not that many people who show up because most people are not going to come to that gym willy nilly in the summer when they don't necessarily have to be there. It's a bad, tra it's some bad traffic stuff happening too. Traffic stoppage. But uh, this is delaying me even more. But. We'll debate that. We'll figure that out. But I'll talk to you guys when I get to the gym and get out of this traffic and stop. Give me the number, 635. It's good enough. See you guys tomorrow.